Yes. So we'll be learning how to use this beading machine, this pail machine. I so love it. My reason is because it's it's lightweight, it's easy to use. In fact, if you want to drop a client's clothes and you feel the beads you added is not much, just put it inside your bag, put your beads, you add more to their satisfaction. So simple as that. It's not heavy. So these are the dices that comes with it. They are usually five. Then mine came with an extra straw. In fact, it actually came with two extra straws. But one has lost, unfortunately. Then I've used and used my beads. I just thought to share the video. These are the sizes of beads. And you see, this is a bigger size. This is a small size. It's This is the biggest size of bead. I do not have that. Followed by this. Then we have this next three. The range in order. So the next is the rivet pin. The rivet pin. The rivet pin is this. This is the rivet pin. Can you see? This is the reverse pin. This is how tiny it is. Can you see? So let's move to business. Looking at the fact that this is the available um, pin that I have, all you do is you you fix to this hole. You fix to this hole, this part. You make sure it locks. Make sure it locks. And once that is done, the next is to pick your pin. Can you see? Just one pin is enough. A pin is enough. Just one. And you place it here. So once you do that, you put your bead inside this hole. Inside this hole inside this hole can you see inside this hole then whatever fabric you want to use you bring out the fabric so i want to use this doll face this black doll face so you place it in you press it well can you see press it firmly and you bring it out you make sure can you see once you use done firmly this this is the um pin this is the pin is locked properly then this is the bead so it's locked properly and this is the bead so let's do one more for this big size of bead can you see i'm putting it here then this the pin can you see so this is it so once you don't want to use this size anymore you are free to change it you're free to change it to another size that you likely want to use so i'll be changing it now to this small one Changing it to this small one. Then place my rivet pin. Then very small bead. Can you see the bead is also there? You see? It's placed firmly. Do you get? There's the bead. So let's do one last one. So the rivet pin is one size. It's one size and it would work for all sizes of um, beads. It would work for all sizes of beads that you need. It's one size to work for all sizes of bead that you need. So that's it. That's that about it. 
that about it. I used it to, I was able to use it to do this bow completely. I was able to do use it to do this bow completely. Can you get, you see? So this is the under. You see how neat it is. See how neat it is. So, thank you very much for watching.